The pace is set for 73 seconds through 500 meters, which is about 58 seconds through the 400. Uh, with the assistance of the Wavelight technology, this rabbit should do an exceptional job. Um, it's the expectation of the athletes, and it's the job of the athletes to get right in their tail and follow them to the promised land. So the pacer getting, trying to get out in front, but we do have Kayla Edwards charging out front too. She means business tonight, and they are well ahead of the wave lights, but that, as expected, as you want to get some change in the bank in the 800 meters to start out. But that's Edwards, and then Raven Rogers, and Nia Akins, and Taryn Rawlings on the inside, and then Rogers' teammate McKenna Keegan wearing the Nike Union Athletics Club uniform behind Rawlings. But now the Pacers ducking out on the inside, and Kayla Edwards really wants to get after this pace. You've seen Kayla attempt this strategy a couple of times this year. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but she's running so aggressively from the front, and unfortunately there were some photographers after the finish line there preventing the rabbit from getting out of her way a bit more quickly. Uh, but we know Raven Rogers has a fiery finish, and so Kayla's trying to get as far away from her as she can, charging down the backstretch, so you have Rogers right on Edwards, followed closely by Akins. A 57-5 through the quarter as they drive down the backstretch. Edwards still in front, and to see Raven Rogers this close to Edwards, this is going to be a special performance because Nia, we know that Rogers likes to hang back. And Nia Akins is also an incredibly strong 800 meter runner. You know, these women not fading at all, not giving an inch over the final course of this race. And Rogers pulls up on the outside of Edwards' shoulder with 100 meters to go. And is that inside window going to open for Akins? Here it is. And it does. This is the move. Now it is Rogers and Akins down the stretch. The Union Athletics Club Passed on the inside the twice. Rogers, the defending champion, and now Aikens driving to the line. A huge victory here in the Electric Forest for Nia Aikens as she ducks under the two minute mark, 159 37. The Brooks Beasts have had a storied history here in the 800 meters at the Portland Track Festival, but it has been historically on the men's side. Tonight, Nia Aikens notches her victory for the women.